lose my breath when you walk in there. We're back, guys. We're back. Uh, you know, I'm not confident enough to say that <laughs> we're here to stay, but uh as quickly as I get obsessed with something, that's how quickly I get burnt out. Uh, that's how it was for me with reactions and uh, K-pop. We'll see how it goes this time. I heard it's a symptom of ADHD, but uh, yeah, I don't know how I, I could get prescribed that at all <laughs> for that. But either way, Charlie Puth featuring uh, Stray Kids featuring Charlie Puth. I actually don't listen to Charlie. I don't listen to many Western artists a lot. I just uh, hear them through passing, but I did stumble upon a short of them doing a dance challenge. And I did hear the, a snippet, a spoiler of the song a bit. It's like, a, wow. It's like the somber RMB. Interesting, different color for Stray Kids, but it sort of fits with Charlie. But with that, let's get to the video. It's fully English. Full vocals. Ooh. The tremble or like vibrato? That's so satisfying to listen to. Oh. Dang, some of the vocal tone changed a lot. Oh, that trembling. So cool. Okay, so Charlie's on the full chorus. Fully English too. Oh my god, is that Sunmin this time? Oh, it so suits him so well. The falsetto. No shot. <laughs> no shot. It's bitty bitty. It's <laughs> Soulful R&B, but it fits fits the vocalist so well. And Changbin. <laughs> Ooh, Bang Chen. Ooh, great harmony. Shout out to Charlie. Oh, that tremble vibrato. Oh, breath. I like that. Oh. 
That's so satisfying. And we're going to be rating all the videos and we're going to be ranking all the titles of every uh, video. I'm going to consider this a title. Wow, we got to actually rank the Stray Kids titles here and now, huh? Let's do that. Be right back. For now, the rating of the song? Oh. Like, so, so obviously for that standard song, pop song structure, it's, it's a completely different color. So it's going to be very hard to rate it. For what it is, that, that somber R&B soul, full vocal folk centric song, I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. Perfect, I, I, I like it, I like it. I'm gonna listen to this, I'm gonna listen to this a lot. Woo, we're back after like an hour. I think that was 30 minutes, yeah, 30 minutes. <sighs> These are our rankings, guys. Oh, current bias coming on. Oh my God. Can I, do I have to choose one? I can't. <laughs> I can't. Uh, I know it's a cop out, but I can't. But these are my current rankings from first to last. God, that took a while. That took a while. A lot of you might be surprised. Why? Why? Why is this song so low? Why is this song so high? Um, that's a whole nother video. I think you guys might be surprised with this. Maybe not being first. A huge factor that went into my rankings has got to be the rap line, the rap line, and their the instrumentals and maniacs. That was something. An instrumental that they used behind Han and Chongbin's Rob. It's just phenomenal. Holy, I would, I would even, I would even argue that Thunderous is crazy too. It's more of like a tie here. Oh, either way, either way, let's rank lose my rap. It's more of a, more of a vocal centric song. Not your classic Stray Kids sound. So it's gotta go down below in like the ballad rankings. I'm gonna put it here. Yeah. Lose my breath. Yeah, I think that's good. It's very, it's very interesting that they didn't go with the Stray Kids color when they're going into the West, I guess. So to show people that don't know of them what they're about. But then again, if you're collaborating with Charlie, where does he really fit into that type of style, right? It just wouldn't work. So that's why they went, they kind of, uh, assimilated into more of charlie style that r&b soul my money would be this was charlie song that he composed and then yeah they just went off of uh, his song and stray kids matched their their color to his but that's gonna be it for now we're gonna be doing the dance practice and everything extra content on patreon see you guys then peace out